Hey people, it's JGP Etching and uh, I'm going to review the Transformers Creo Jads. Uh, he's um, bigger than Bumblebee. His doors can open so he can fit one Creon inside. But what I don't like is that. Oh, so yeah. There's this bit blocking it so he can't. Unless you open this, he can't get in. Speaking of the Creons, uh, they're nicely articulated for little figures. The arms are on ball joints, hands can rotate. Waist can move 360, legs can are on ball joints, and the head can turn as well. And he also has a little helmet, so when he drives, jazz. And here's Jazz Creon, supposed to be his G1 version. A uh, nice little laser gun there, so he can pew, shoot in the face. And he's got black tips on his feet, that's cool. And uh, you can remove the helmet. Uh, I'll put it on him so I, see, so I can show you how to try and remove it. Okay, so here's the face. I think it's the same as Bumblebee's head. The eyes and stuff. Put back on. These are really cool, awesome little figures. And for fun, you can stick the crayons in their, um, the vehicles if you want to. But enough of that. Onto the figure. It's, I mean, onto the vehicle mode itself. Yes, this will be a two-part review because yeah, uh, you don't want to watch me building it. As you can see, it's this is movie first version. Uh, also, it's G1 version because of the stripes and blue stripes. Uh, rolls really nicely, and he's also got rubber wheels, so you can bounce. I guess he's got four there, 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 and there's a stripe that goes all the way up. To there, which I find quite awesome. There's an Autobot logo there. It says Jazz on the back, like with Bumblebee. Uh, I really like this car mode. I didn't think I was going to like it at first, but I actually really like it. And to stick them inside, it's actually easier to take the windows off there. Just stick them in there. There's a little steering wheel in there. Just put that back on there, and uh, he can drive Jazz. Wee! Speaking of Jazz, let's try and put him in there. Obviously, we have to take his wings off first. I also really like that their waist rotate as well. Okay, so wings off, gun out of his hand, legs positioned, arms positioned. In the car, we got a jazz in a jazz. <laughs> That's awesome. Shut that. Now he jazz can drive himself. That's really funny. Oh, he's got a spoiler, which I find awesome. And uh, there are some leftover parts. <laughs> this is quite funny. Uh, I came up with this myself. This is the stuff that you can use to build the robot mode. Uh, this is good. This is enough for part two. Uh, uh, stay tuned for part four, where we look at his robot mode. Bye for now.